Today's video is going to be a day in the life. It's going to be very random, but pretty important. Today's voiceover is brought to you by Sore Throat. And today's video is brought to you by Lux SB. Lux SB is a perfume subscription service and I'm going to be sharing with you what I got in from them. Just keep watching to find out more about Lux SB and as always all of the information will be down below in the description. Now let's get to this video y'all. Hey y'all welcome back to my channel. So today's video I'm either going to be doing all cleaning or like a day in the life. I haven't really decided yet but man I woke up this morning and this right here it's like all swole and I have a sore throat. Ugh, I was not expecting to wake up with this and I'm so annoyed with it because I hate being sick. I don't know if it's like a cold or what's going on, but ugh, like I can feel all this is so swole and my throat hurts. And then I was putting my clothes on um, to start this video and I pulled something in my shoulder or my arm and I'm like seriously can this day get any worse like oh my gosh and on top of all of this my face is so swole <laughs> I am just a mess today you guys this face is swole my eyes are swole I'm like <laughs> I don't know what's going on with me but anyway, I hope you guys are listening to this part of the video right now because I wanted to say I would appreciate it if each and every person who's watching would watch the entire video and not fast forward or skip. Not only because views and watch time are super important here on YouTube, but I am going to be sharing some things that I don't want you guys to miss out on and then end up asking me about it later and I'll be like, hello, did you not watch the video? Because that usually happens. Everyone likes to skip through the important stuff and you miss out on a lot of stuff and I don't know, when people end up asking me a question that I've already given an answer to in my video, it always kind of makes me feel weird. And I almost feel bad for saying that, but at the same time, I shouldn't feel bad because I usually put a lot of answers in my video. So yeah, but I'm sharing some important stuff. Seriously, I'm not trying to be rude. Yeah, so it's like 9, 12 and man, I wanted to work out today, but I, like this is like, I don't know, it don't feel good, but we'll see. Let's get this day started. I'm going to shut up now. I see why y'all be skipping because <laughs> I talk too much. Oh, this voice is bad. So yeah, I'm just going to start off by making my bed and I swear my shoulder got worse by the second and I really didn't feel like doing anything, but I decided to just go ahead and do a few things today because I really, really needed to. And yes, before you ask, I am lint rolling my blanket, which I have never done before, but the back side of my comforter is all black and I have two white cats and they like to lay on this blanket a lot. So it was covered in cat hair and I was just trying to get some of that off, but Cookie ended up climbing up there anyway and getting right back on it. So that was totally pointless.
So now I'm gonna start cleaning up my living room just a little bit. I'm not doing no major cleaning today because I really didn't feel good and like I said my shoulder was hurting and honestly it's pointless to do anything in here at the moment because we are not going to be in here much longer which is one of the things I wanted to talk to you guys about and that's why I said I wanted y'all to watch the entire video and not skip anything so yeah it's true we are moving again which is why my place has been a mess for the past few weeks but I just didn't say anything you guys know I like to keep up with my home and keep it clean but y'all been seeing it look like a tornado blew through here and that is why because we're moving out of here so I just didn't feel like doing much because I knew I wasn't going to be in here anyway so I'm just getting rid of some garbage and some boxes and I'm packing a few things away I'm not doing a major pack in because I'm not doing it all by myself and Alan's at work but I'm just doing a little packing up for now and I know that I'm going to get a lot of messages and a lot of questions and I promise I'm going to get back to all of y'all the first chance I get but for the next few days I'm going to be super super busy so yeah just give me a little bit of time and then I will explain it all to y'all So now I'm taking all of my mixed tiles off the wall and this was honestly kind of satisfying. These little things are so easy to take down. They're really easy to put up and they're really easy to remove and they leave no damage which is awesome especially if you move a lot and you don't want to damage your walls but I'm just taking them all down but it kind of made me sad because I'll never see this little wall with these pictures on here again. But anyway. Yeah, that's what I'm doing now is just taking down all of my mixed tiles. So while I was cleaning just now, this was sitting on my counter and I had put it away, but since I'm in the middle of cleaning and speaking of cleaning, I wanted to show you guys this. So I had seen a thing online the other day about how dirty our phones are and um, I come across this so I got it because it really freaked me out. So this is the Homedics UV Clean Phone Sanitizer. It's the modern world's biggest hygiene problem solved, it says. Look at this. <laughs> it says dirty airport, bathroom break, gym locker room, coworker sneeze, E. coli bacteria, your next cold. <laughs> and of course I wake up um, with a sore throat. But anyway, so I haven't opened it yet. I haven't tried it yet. I wanted to share it with you guys because I thought it was really interesting. Um, but I am going to be using this. So this says it has a pop-up technology kills up to 99.9 .9 of bacteria uv clean led um in 30 seconds yeah i'm gonna be using this today because let's be honest this little thing goes everywhere right 
<laughs> Yuck. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna be using this later, but I just wanted to show it to you real quick because while I was cleaning off the counter, it was up there and um, yeah, <laughs> it was just sitting there. I haven't opened it yet. I am gonna be trying it out. It says cleans in 30 seconds per side, 99.9% .9 of bacteria, it's crazy. No chemical, just a UVC light, um, yeah. So stay tuned later in the video, I'm gonna be testing this out. Uh, think about how dirty your phone is. Yeah, because I know mine goes everywhere with me, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so yeah, I'll be trying this later, so. Stay tuned when I do so you can see how it works and um, see what I think about it and all that fun stuff. But anyway, I have to get back to cleaning. I'm already getting out of breath. Um, I need to go down and take all of this garbage. I've got some garbage that needs to be taken to the garbage can and then I have even more garbage. It's like boxes and things I just need to throw out now. So yeah. Anyways, oh, I also have to get all these labeled. Oh my gosh, I have so much to do today. I'm stressing, y'all. I swear, it must be sinuses or something because I just looked in the mirror and I'm like, my face is still so swole. Oh. But anyways, your girl's getting hungry, so I'm gonna go ahead and make me some breakfast. I think I'm gonna have me a smoothie. That's what I think. This is the most convenient little thing ever. So I'm gonna be using my Teamy Smoothie Maker today. This is the bottom part, it's the power part. And then this is the cup and you just snap it on to make your smoothie. It's amazing. Perfect for on the go or at home like I do. It's great, trust me. So I bought a bunch of bananas the other day and I don't like my bananas going bad so I freeze them. Just cut them up and uh, freeze them so you can use them in your smoothie. Plus, it makes your smoothie a hundred times better. I love adding frozen fruit to my smoothie. And y'all, have you ever ate a frozen banana? It's a really good treat. Now I know a lot of people don't like cold stuff on their teeth and stuff, but these are actually not hard as a rock. They're like, you can chew them. And we just go slow with it. It's so good. So good. Anyway. Get some other frozen fruit here because this has like mango, papaya. No, no, no. Pineapple, strawberry, peaches, and mango. Throw some of that in there. Next, I'm gonna add a little vanilla soy milk. And the other part, I'm gonna do water. Now I'm gonna add in some of my Avi um, Super Collagen Protein Powder. All of the flavors are delicious, so I have a really hard time like deciding what I wanna use. But to be honest, I've been doing the cocoa cereal like every day now. I've been using this one a lot, so I'm gonna go ahead and switch up to the frosted cereal, which is supposed to be like frosted flakes or whatever. So yeah, we'll switch it up today, do a little frosted cereal. If you wanna try out this protein powder, I highly recommend it. And I also have a coupon code for my followers so you can save a little money on your purchase. Um, this is lactose free. It is gluten-free, non-GMO, it's keto-friendly, I think it's sugar-free. I forget a lot sometimes, but yeah, it's filled with lots of good stuff for you, and it's delicious, and you can add it to all kinds of things. You don't have to just put it in a smoothie. You can bake with it, you can put it in your coffee. Girl, so many options. So, all you have to do is um, take it off of this base part here, and then you can press this button, the lid pops open, you can drink it this way, there's a little spout there, but I like to pour mine in the cup. If I was out and about, um, I would just drink it from here, and I have drank it from here just being at home, 
But I like to have mine in a cup with a straw. I don't know why, I just do. So, I'm just gonna take the lid off. Pour it right into my cup. Ooh, this is so thick. I love a thick smoothie. Sometimes I have a hard time getting like the perfect balance of stuff, like texture or whatever. I'm putting the right amount in to make it thick, but I, I did it this time. Probably the frozen bananas did it, honestly. So then you can hand wash it or put it in your dishwasher. Not this part though, don't ever get this part wet. Only the cup. There's no reason for this to be clean. Keep it clean, honey. All right, let's taste. <laughs> take a little break I'm gonna sit down check my emails check some messages enjoy my breakfast and then I'm gonna get back to work So I took the garbage and now I'm gonna start um, getting all these labels ready to send these packages off. Yeah, so I just have to weigh them and do all that fun stuff and get them ready to be shipped. There was a delay in shipment by the way, so if you haven't received your package yet, it's because we ran out of mailers, so we had to put an order in and wait for them and we just got these in. So the packages are going out now. So I've been sitting here getting my labels ready. Um, uh, the place where I buy my labels from, sometimes I'm like so fast that they flag it for like fraud. <laughs> so I have to take a break and let my bank process it and realize that it's just me. So fun stuff. Anyway, so I'm taking a break from that, but I got a lot done, thank God. Um, but I decided to go ahead and try out this Homedix UV clean phone sanitizer. I'm gonna open it now because my curiosity is getting the best of me. There is a plug, like a USB plug. And then, let's see what we got here. I'm excited about this. Do you know that when you're having like um, a breakout, sometimes it's cause your phone's dirty? Wanna know why? That dirty phone, if you don't clean it, is touching your skin especially if you talk on the phone a lot or any phone, girl. Anyways, yeah, I always tell people that whenever they're having like skin issues, I'll name off like all kinds of things and I'll be like, you know, do this, do this, do this. And one of those things is always your phone. Ew. Anyways, look at this. This is really neat looking. It's sharp. So it's like this little case. Click the on button. Okay, this is interesting. It's so smooth, nice. Place phone here, remove sticker before use. Okay. Unzip the case and place your device in. I'm gonna go ahead and just stick the whole phone in. I'm not even taking the case off. We're just gonna stick the whole phone inside here. I'm gonna zip it up, pop it up. Oh, that's cool for extra room. All right. Okay, well guess what? I think I have to charge it first. It's not charged. I was really excited about this. So I need to take my phone back out in case I get any important phone calls, but we're gonna charge this baby up. I'm gonna come back and we're gonna try it out. So this is cool because there's the power button and then here is where you just plug it up, get it going. So I'm gonna go plug this up and let it charge and I guess I'll finish my labels and we'll come back and test this out. 
Okay, so I finished up with all my labels. Cookie is watching over all of it for me to make sure they're safe. <laughs> I had my um, sanitizer charging, so I'm gonna unzip it. We're gonna put the phone in. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that phone in. We're gonna close it up. Okay, so you have to make sure this little zipper, um, it's like a magnet thing, it just holds on to there so they know that it's closed completely. Blue light is going, which means my phone is being sanitized, which is just amazing to me. And I absolutely love this. So it says it's 30 seconds and then it's done. When the blue light turns off, <gasps> there it is. Now, when I open this, my phone is gonna be completely germ-free. I'm so excited about this. Ta-da! Nobody said it would be fingerprint free, but I'm gonna go ahead and also take this case off and I'm gonna clean it again without the case. So here on the side, the zipper will attach to there. Turn her on, blue light, and sanitizing. Also, this doesn't have to be popped up. It can actually be closed like that, but I guess maybe if you need like extra room. Um, and yeah, so you can just take this with you wherever, which I think is amazing. Super, um, you know, like a good size. It's portable, good for on the go and travel. And yeah, your phone gets sanitized and you ain't gotta worry about germs and things like that. So I wanted to share just a little bit more information with you guys just in case um, you were curious. So this UV clean fits most phones regardless of size, make, or model. Um, it's stylish and compact and has up to 70 uses per charge. That's awesome. Um, it's available in three different colors. It's safer than wipes. Um, it doesn't require any harmful chemicals or liquids. It kills up to 99.9% .9 of bacteria and viruses at the, DNA, at the DNA level and is environmentally safer, free of mercury and chemicals. It cleans ultra fast. Oh, so it actually says to um, put your phone in there, do it once and then flip your phone and repeat. So I need to do the other side too. Their website also says that your phone is 10 times dirtier than a toilet seat. That is disgusting. I'm reading it all on my computer right now. That makes me like feel gross. It says if your phone isn't clean, your hands won't be either. Ew! So UV cleaning is one of the smartest things you can do to minimize contact with bacteria and viruses to keep you and your family healthy. Um, hold up, y'all. Let's go for that second clean. I think this thing is awesome and they also gave me a coupon code to share with my followers, which I'll put down below. Um, and yeah, the little coupon code ends on March 31st of 2020 if you want to purchase this and try it out. I'm kind of like grossed out right now. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, this little thing's pretty cool. I'm glad I got it and I'm going to continue using it because my phone has officially grossed me out forever. Anyway, Alan just got home. He got home early from work today, so... I think I'm going to print out the labels. I have to tape them on. It's pretty time consuming, but I'll get it done. I don't think I'm gonna do any more cleaning in here today, but I do need to shower and all that fun stuff. Oh yeah, and I also wanted to um, show you guys the perfume I got in from Lux SB. I forgot about that. My brain is like just somewhere else right now. And also, I'm going to be announcing the um, the prize winners. So if you made a purchase with us the other day through our live and you paid, you sent in a payment, you will be entered to win this giveaway. So I hope you guys have been listening and watching because I said I was gonna be putting some information in here. You gotta watch the whole video to find out. So no skipping y'all. Anyway, phone is done, sanitized. Wish I could put my whole body in here. That would be great, but yeah. So I just got out of the shower and um, I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare. I was thinking about doing like a little get ready with me, but I don't really know what I'm gonna be doing. So I guess I'll film whatever I'm doing right now. I'm applying this Juice Beauty. <laughs> I'm laughing at my cat whining in the background. 
I'm applying this Juice Beauty Stem Cellular Anti-Wrinkle Eye Treatment. And then I'm gonna go in with some of my favorite cashmere toning oil. Next, I'm gonna go in with a little bit of Saturday Skin Waterfall um, Glacier Water Cream. All right, I'm gonna give this a few minutes to sink in, and then I'm gonna go in with some more products. <laughs> All right, so next I'm gonna go in with some of my Juno Moonshine Miracle Cream. If I can open it, my hands are super lotion-y right now. I've literally just been using the lid of this because there's always so much on it, so. Ooh, I think I did a little too much, but that's all right. I'm gonna let this sink in and then I'm gonna go in and do my makeup. I gotta go check on my cat. She's crying for some reason. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with some of this Undone Beauty Unfoundation Glow Tint. Boy, I'm just gonna apply it with my fingers because that's what I feel like doing at the moment. Just apply it all over. What is that noise? Sounds like something from a scary movie. Okay, so now that I got that on, I'm gonna go in with a little bit of this GIS Cosmetics Concealer. This is the C2 Warm Yellow. I really love this concealer for like, almost like a, what is the word I'm looking for? Not a primer, but a color corrector kind of because it's the shade that it is, it's <clears throat> a really good color corrector to like put on before you do concealer. So I'm gonna go in with some of this Givenchy um, Everwear Concealer in the shade 14. The way my desk is set up makes it so hard to like do makeup videos, which is why I don't really do it. I need to figure out a new setup for myself. So now I'm gonna go in with some of this new Gerard Cosmetics. This is a clean canvas um, base, and it's meant to be used for like eyeshadow base and all that stuff, but this stuff has such good color and coverage that um, I've really been enjoying putting it on my eyelids, and a little bit goes a long way, so like don't overdo it if you try this stuff. But it's amazing, it has like amazing, amazing coverage. Um, and you know I like to cover up like my dark circles and the, the inner dark circles here. So this isn't supposed to be a concealer, but it just covers so good and brightens up that top um, eye area for me. So yeah, I've been using this for that and I love it. And you can order it straight from the Gerard Cosmetics website. I have a coupon code if you guys wanna try it. I'll put everything down below. But yeah, it's really good for an eyeshadow base. And uh, yeah, it just covers that up so well and I love it. I'm gonna go in with some of that e.l.f. Uh, contour palette. I'm like so off my game today. I can't find like what brushes I wanna use. Just applying some of this because I want some color. Now that I'm blended, I'm gonna go in with some of this Lip to Cheek Palette in the shade Blazin. And this is also from Undone. Ooh. This is also from Undone Beauty. And it's a cream um, blush. And you can use it on your eyes and your lips and all that. I think it's gorgeous. Um, that's the same company that made that foundation I just put on. I'm just gonna blend this out so it's not too crazy. Also going in with a little bit of that e.l.f. Um, the contour palette, and I'm just picking up the dark shade on there. I'm kind of using it as an eyeshadow, just to kind of define my eyes a little bit. Not really making a big deal out of it. Just doing a little bit, and then blending it out. I'm probably gonna do my eyebrows last and off camera, just because I don't feel like doing that right now. I'm gonna take a little bit of this eyeliner. It's just a black pencil. And I'm not gonna fully line my eyes. I'm just gonna, well, you'll see. I'm just gonna kinda half do it like, I don't know. 
I feel like I want to wear makeup today, but I don't really feel like wearing a lot. So yeah, I'm just gonna do minimal, but still like have makeup on, if you know what I'm saying. You ever feel that way? Like you want to put makeup on, but you don't really feel like it, so. That's what I'm doing. I'm just gonna put a little bit of pencil halfway on my eye. I'm gonna smudge it a little bit so it's not perfect. Cause I'm not in a perfect mood today. So, um, my camera ran out of memory. I had to delete stuff quick. But I just smudged some like brown eyeshadow on the bottom here. And as you can see, this top is just super messy, but I'm gonna pile up a lot of mascara on so it's gonna kind of hide that. Um, I need to blend my makeup a little bit better. I look so orange right now. Hi, I'm an Oompa Loompa. But anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do some mascara and I'm going to do my eyebrows. I'm gonna clean this up a little bit, maybe smudge it all a little bit more, but I'm not gonna be adding anything else to my eyes except the mascara. So I'll see you in a little bit because I have to clear my memory card off. Okay, so I just finished my makeup. I did my mascara. I smeared my eyeliner a little bit more. <laughs> I wanted a little messy today because I just don't care. Um, took my hair out of the towel and I put in my leave-in stuff and I just brushed my hair. And I wanted to talk to you guys about the Lux SB perfumes that I got from Lux SB. So Lux SB is a perfume subscription service and you guys know I love my perfumes and I love to switch up a lot. So. Um, something like this is perfect for me because I don't have to commit to a full-size bottle. Um, they give you actually like a really good amount in their bottles, so it's perfect for me. I can switch up my scents anytime. So you can actually go throughout their website and pick whatever scent you would like, or a specialist will actually pick a scent for you that is based on like the profile that you create on their website. If you guys want to check out Lux SB and get a new perfume, I have an awesome deal for you guys that the company has given me for my followers which is so sweet right now you can actually get 35% off of your first order so take advantage of that I'm gonna put the links and all of the information down below so it's pretty simple you just sign up on their website create your profile choose which plan is best for you you can build your calendar on there and receive new cents monthly it's all up to you you just go through the options and choose whatever um, plan that you decide so I actually got two perfumes for me and one for Alan Alan loves cologne and loves to smell good. So let's open up this package. So they have a little flyer here that just shows you how to um, open up the little um, refill bottle and how to refill it and all that fun stuff. It says, welcome to Lux SB and thank you for becoming a member, matching you with the perfect scent, one fragrance at a time. And these are the three perfumes that I got. Look how cute these little boxes are. So Lux SB actually offers one of the biggest travel size perfume amounts out there. Like it's the largest size available in perfume subscription services. They have over 500 designer and niche scents to choose from and they get new arrivals monthly. These are 100% authentic and it's no contract, it's month to month, cancel anytime and free shipping. They start at $15 a month, but you can use the promo code and get a discount on your first order, like I said. <laughs> Let's open this up and see which one is first. Look at the cute little packaging, and these come in different colors. So this one is black and silver, and the first smell we have here is Burberry, my Burberry blush. I actually picked this one out. Let's spray it on this arm, get a little smell. Oh my God, that smells so good. Powdery, fresh, clean, beautiful, pretty. Oh, it smells amazing. So yeah, this is the Burberry, my Burberry blush. This one came in the black and silver. Super easy to use. This is the um, perfume here and this is just the case. You pop it in like that, twist down, twist up to use and when you wanna remove it, you just pull it out. It's so, so easy. Perfect for travel, perfect for throwing in your purse on the go. If you don't want to carry around a bulky perfume because it takes up too much room in your purse. That's how I feel anyway. And next scent we have here, oh look at this, is in a blue and black case. And this is 
Ooh, I don't know how to pronounce it. So there was actually another perfume I had wanted, but they were out of stock at the moment. So they suggested this one, which is really cool. So let's see if I like this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is the name of it. It says Vanilla Extreme. That smells delicious. I've never heard of that, but oh my gosh. I could eat that right now. It smells so good. It's like sweet vanilla, kind of cupcake-ish. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's absolutely beautiful. Next up here is Alan's. So, funny thing about this is Alan actually got this cologne for Christmas because he's obsessed with it, but he also wanted a travel size that he could keep in his truck and stuff or touch-ups or whatever. Um, so he got this one, this is in the gold and black case and this smells so good. You need to get some for your man <laughs> because it smells so good. So this is the Coach Platinum. And this is, Lord, <laughs> it smells so good. You have to try it. It's Coach Platinum for men. It smells amazing. So yeah, that's the cologne he got. First month um, includes one of these for free, which is the traditional silver and black case for your perfume. You guys should check out Love's SB. I'm gonna put the link down below as well as the coupon code. These are literally amazing. If you're looking for new scents to try and you like vanilla, I would try the vanilla. If you like something that's like soft and powdery yet beautiful, I would go for the Burberry Blush. And of course, if you're looking for a new men's cologne, Coach Platinum is awesome. These are super affordable, super convenient. They smell so good. I love the little outer cases. I love that I can just throw it in my purse and it doesn't take up any room and I can take my perfume with me because I like to wear a lot of perfume, especially when I'm going somewhere. I like to reapply it right when I go to leave the truck. I'm like, hold on. That way when I walk in, someone says, oh girl, you smell good. <laughs> I love that. I'm gonna include all the information down below in the description. Check out the website, use the code, save some money, get some new perfume. Smell amazing. All right, I'm gonna go blow dry this hair. I'll see you in a little bit. I don't know what else we're doing today, but oh my gosh, I still have to print those labels out. So glad I just remembered that. Oh, I also forgot they come with these little velvet cases. I just seen it sitting there on top of the packaging. Yeah, they come with these little velvet cases, which is really cute. You just pop it in and take it with you. So adorable. So I blow dried my hair a little bit and it's frizzing up anyway because it's so humid right now. And I didn't know it till I checked um, the weather. It's like 80 degrees outside. So this is just, it's gonna be a mess today and there's nothing I can do about it. How you doing? Oh, that's a pretty girl. <laughs> anyway, so I guess we're fixing to go somewhere. I don't know where we're going, but you can come, come on. So, I haven't been vlogging because, I don't know, I don't ever feel comfortable taking the camera out in public too much. It gets kind of awkward. This needs to focus. Anyway, we just got home, I'm out of breath. Uh, my arm and shoulder is still hurting me so bad, I don't know what I did. But um, we went, where did we go? We went to Walmart because I had to get some soap. And I got a new concealer, I'll show you that. And then we went and got some pizza, so I don't think I'm gonna be cooking dinner tonight. I think that was dinner, so I guess that's good. <laughs> and uh, I had the labels printed out, and then I forgot them in the truck, so Alan went to go get them for me. And then I have to put them on all the packages, and then I still have to go to the post office. Oh, let me show you my uh, concealer I got. It's Flower Brand, which is from, um, Drew Barrymore. My hair is driving me insane. Drew Barrymore, her makeup line. And it's the Light Illusion Full Coverage Concealer, Weightless Feel, Crease Proof, Soft Angle Tip, yada yada. I took a chance on the color. I just got the shade Light. They look really weird in the box. Like you couldn't tell what color they were in the box. But I think this one matches me. Thanks, babe. Um, 
Anyway, yeah, so I got this color and I think it matches me good. I just decided to try a new concealer and I wanted to try a drugstore one. So yeah, this is the flower one. We'll see how that goes. I like tested a little bit on my face and it matched, so whatever. But I already have makeup on, so I don't know like how well it's gonna work. So yeah. There's Alan. Hi, Alan. How are you? So. Anyway, so I have to go ahead and do these labels now, so maybe I'll film a little bit again later. And we still have to draw the names for the giveaway. Haven't done that yet. We're gonna do that. I've been waiting for um, a few other people to like send their payments in so that they could be entered or whatever, but we'll see in a little bit. We'll pull some names for the winners. So I wrote down everybody's name on a little piece of paper. I folded them up and I'm gonna let Alan draw the winner. There's going to be two different winners. Don't be trying to, are you trying to fast forward? Don't. And also don't say congratulations to the person down below. I want them to watch this video in its entirety. <laughs> All right, so we're going to pull the first name. Shake it up good. Don't be looking at the papers. You're trying to unfold them and read. I, I just need to make sure it's one paper. Okay. All right, I got a winner. Who is it? Nana. Nana! Congratulations, Nana. Congratulations, Nana. Nana. Woo! Oh, Nana. You won. <laughs> what kind of song was that? <laughs> Are right, you ready to pull the other one? Yeah, for the second, second winner. Drawing, drum roll please. The birds are making sure to give you a drum roll in there. I got another one. Okay, so when he pulled the last winner, I don't know if it was even on my camera because the thing popped up and said it ran out of memory, but just in case, the winner was mad. Did you see it when it popped up? No. Was it after you said it? Probably. It was probably before. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully. Ba -ba -da -ba, ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, so Maggie. And also, congratulations to all you ladies who entered. You are all winners. I wanted to say that. <laughs> Drop the mic. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, so contact me and we'll talk about your prize. Ooh. So now we are up in the Dollar Tree. I found a really nice Dollar Tree in my area and it looks really good. I wanted to show you guys some stuff. This Gain uh, Blissful Breeze smells amazing. And then I found this, which I'm actually going to buy. It's Pine Sol Tropical Flowers. It smells so good. Look at these. This is like a pretty good deal. Disinfectant wipes, bathroom cleaner, all kinds of stuff, y'all. These also smell really good. The cherry blossom scent and the pomegranate and the rose water. It smells amazing. Look at all this nice stuff, y'all. All right, so we just got back home from the Dollar Tree and I wanna show you guys what I got. I got some Epsom salt. I love to have Epsom salt on hand. And I ran out, so this is a nice size bag for a dollar. I got some Hall's cough drops cause my throat's killing me. And I ended up buying this. It smells so good. And then I also found these. I don't know if you guys remember when my mother-in-law had bought these. They were delicious and I'm so happy I found them because I've been craving them. So if you ever see these in the Dollar Tree, pick them up because they are so tasty. But yeah, that's my little Dollar Tree haul. Cutesy. And here's Kiki. Hi Kiki. How are you? Bye Kiki. Hi Cookie. Hi, Cookie Puri. That's beautiful. That's a beautiful cat. So anyways, it's like seven something and I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this video because I don't really feel good. I feel like I'm getting a fever or something. I'm having body aches. Maybe that's why my arm was hurting when I woke up and my throat's hurting. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face, put my jammas on and just snuggle up with a blanket on the couch because I'm just not feeling really good. But anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave me some comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. 
um, you know, give my video a like or whatever. And once again, congratulations to the winners. Don't forget to contact me so we can talk about your prize. And I'll see you guys next time.